Hey, I'm Dave from Essential Labs support team. Today I'm going to show you how to place our Essential Countdown Timer on the product page. You can find our products on the Shopify App Store. You simply go there and enter our product name. Once you land on the product page, you simply push Add App. To create a new product page timer, you need to first of all create a new timer. Then you should choose product page type. Once you're here, you need to define all the settings that suits you. You can define a countdown timer name, the title, subheading, timer labels, and the timer type. It could be countdown to a specific date, it could be fixed minutes, or it could be daily recurring timer. Next step is configuring the design. You can go with a custom one or you can choose the predefined templates. I really like the fire one, so this is the one I'm choosing. The next step and the final step is the placement. We choose where do we want to place the timer. Do we want to place it on all the products, on the specific products, on the products with specific tags? or a custom position using ad blocks or code snippet. I'm going to go with a classic one, all products, save. Once I save, I can publish it. I can preview countdown in my personal Shopify store by clicking on this button. As you can see, it was placed by default under the add to cart and buy it now buttons. It is also possible to change the position of the countdown timer by using ad blocks or custom code snippet, but I'll cover this in the next video. Thanks for being a part of Essential Apps.